everybody. It's Chad with round two. Happy New Year. It's January already, so um, being that it is a new year, for those of you who haven't uh, tuned into these videos from the beginning, just a quick explanation as to how they work. Um, this is our, our monthly release videos for round two products, so what this is is we get new product in. Um, if we show it on the video, that means that it's uh, on a ship, it's on its way over here, usually about three to four weeks out for a distribution center, so I uh, expect to start seeing it within that time, maybe a couple weeks after that for stores. So for this month, for January, uh, we got a lot of new stuff to show you guys. There's Johnny Lightning, uh, three new cars for straight packs. There's um, a new Racing Champions Mint release that's coming out. We got three Auto World 118 cars and some stuff for um, Polar Lights and AMT model kits that we'll be showing. So nothing for slot cars this month, but we do have a lot coming out. And if you uh, look on our Facebook pages, you can see some information on some new tools and some other cool stuff we're doing uh, with slot cars. So stay tuned. We'll have that coming up shortly. As far as that, we'll get started. We'll jump into uh, Johnny Lightning 64. Okay, so first off for Johnny Lightning, we've got our, uh, these are our straight packs. So the hobby exclusive straight packs that are coming out. And there's three new cars in this. This first one is 1955 Chevy two-door sedan. So we do these in two color variations. This is the black on black version. Looks very great. And version two, red, with the white accents there. Second car for hobby exclusives. This is the 1996 Chevy Impala SS. So we've got two variations of this too. We got this uh, with the black wheels, chrome lip. This is the black color and this is our other color variation, the uh, dark gunmetal. Those chrome looking wheels. And then one more for straight packs. This is a cool one. These are 1969 Chevy Camaro ZL1. So we've got it here in this great looking fathom green color, ZL1 details, those black wheels with that chrome center dish in them. And the uh, ZL1 here in this dark blue. So we got a lot more cool stuff coming for Johnny Lightning. Uh, we'll be showing more of that here shortly. We'll jump in also for 64th. This is our new release for Racing Champions Mint, our other line here. So there's uh, two color variations, A and B for this. So the first car is this 1956 Ford Crown Victoria. Version A is in this great looking mint green, white, and it's got that matching mint green interior. Version two is red and black. Next up. The 1968 Shelby GT500 KR. We've got it in this blue and silver. You can see kind of some of the details there, fog lights, all that stuff. And here it is in this uh, Wimbledon white with the blue racing stripes. After that, 1970 Chevy Chevelle SS. Here it is in gold with black racing stripes. There's SS stripes on it. And here it is in a uh, burgundy with the white stripes. All right, fourth in the release, 1950 Chevy 3100. Version A, great looking red and black. Check out that, that wood panel bed. Looks great in there. And the second version of it, blue and white. 1965 Ford F100 pickup. There it is, black on black for version A. And this aqua and uh, tan white for that one as well. And lastly, it's the 1968 Pontiac Firebird. So we've got it in this kind of, uh, kind of butternut color here and blue with that black final top so that's everything for 164th like I said we'll have a lot more coming out I'll jump in and show you guys 118 next all right so for 118 we got three cool cars in uh, three very different categories so first off this is my personal favorite this month this is the 118 Christine the 1958 Plymouth Fury and this is the uh, dirty version so those of you who um who have watched the movie this is based after the part where uh Arnie finds the car in the field and decides he wants to buy it and fix it up. And uh, for those of you who are Auto World fans, you might know we did an exclusive 
for uh, M and J that had this car in 64 scale, so we brought it out for 118 for all you guys. So it, it's great. It's got that dusty weather look all over it. Detailed interior, detailed um, engine, and uh, everything else. And uh, one bonus with this, it does have working headlights too, which is really cool. And next up for 118, this is something a little different than what we normally do. This is our 2003 Nissan 350Z in Brickyard Red Metallic. So um, what's cool about this, I, besides that great looking paint color, it's got really detailed interior. It's got the uh, detailed engine, steerable front wheels, and a limited edition one of 1002. And lastly, from Auto World and American Muscle, this is the 1969 Dodge Coronet RT, and this is in B5 blue. So some of the cool stuff about this, it's got um, a great looking white interior, and it has the uh, newly tooled side scoop option available on this one as well so lots of cool stuff there next we'll jump in i'll show you guys what's coming up for model kits okay so for uh model kits keeping with the 1969 mopars here this is a new kit this is the 1969 plymouth gtx and this is one of our uh dirty donnie kits so what's cool about this um those of you who know dirty donnie we've done some vans through him we've done uh some resin characters and uh, a few other things we work with him a lot for kits so what's cool about this it comes with these uh, dirty donny designed custom decals it is molded in uh molded in black you can kind of get a look at all the uh, options in the parts tree and everything there uh, great looking box art designed for that kit um, next off we'll keep with the cars this should be a really cool one this is the polar lights 2006 ford gt the uh golf edition so what's cool about this this is a uh, snap kit it is molded in blue um, so it goes together really easily uh, it's got the heritage decals so it comes with that orange decal or the golf decal there's a photo of kind of it assembled even though it is a snap kit it does have a complete engine and a detailed interior so lots of other uh, details when you're building through the kit which is really cool and uh, you know the golf racing stripes side panel stripes masking template rubber tires so it does have a lot of Really great parts, it should make a quick build and a really good looking kit. Um, next up, something for you Star Trek fans out there, this is the Klingon Vorcha class battle cruiser. So some of the cool stuff about this, it hasn't been brought out in uh, probably at least 10 years. Um, it is molded in green, so it should go together um, fairly easy. You don't necessarily have to paint it, and it does have um, red injected parts too for some of the uh, some of the lights and everything else. So. Uh, a couple other features it does have a metal support rod so you can put it up and display it and should look great next to some of the other uh, star trek kits we've released recently and lastly this should be a big one i know a lot of you guys love the big rig kits so this is our uh coca-cola peterbilt 352 pacemaker cab over kit so some of the cool stuff about this it has a ton of parts over 250 parts in this kit um so it's very highly detailed um being that it is a coca-cola version see if i can find it here you got the coca-cola decal sheets you can do all different kinds of variations with the truck which is really cool and then some of the uh, detailed parts it's got these twin fuel tanks exhaust stacks um you know dual exhaust uh, big wheelbase with the heavy duty chassis fifth wheel assemblies truck tires uh just tons and tons of options and cool parts for this kit. So it should be a popular one for all you big rig builders. So that's everything we've got right now for January. Like I said before, we got a lot of stuff coming out. Um, so check us out on our Facebook pages. I'll put those down below or go to round2corp.com. Thanks again, guys.